I've got a camera, let's film something. This is Barnes Common Station. It's got an unusual stairway layout. Let's film some trains. Class 458. Didn't get the number of that one. 458517. Now it just so happens that today is a bank holiday Monday when all of the other lines are closed and trains are being diverted via this line. I thought I was going to be able to film some, but I didn't manage to. Let's film some trains. Person. Seven two four. I'm not actually going to be getting a train. It's Alexander Dennis and Viro four hundred eight. So then I went over on the district line to Wimbledon. I think this bit feels a bit like Portugal. The rubbish trademark network rail lift. A sign said that the Thames link was close between Streatham and Wimbledon, and I just missed a train, so I went by Mit to Mitcham Junction by tram to meet it. Then I found out that the station was closed. Why is there contradictory information at Wimbledon? I went to the bus stop to get a rail replacement and walked up a ramp which had been made completely pointless and hardly any quicker than the road by the desire to have a shallow gradient. Not everyone's disabled. Couldn't they have put stairs in as well as the ramp? <laughs>
now we've left the 30 mile an hour or go to prison London Borough of Merton and we've entered the 20s plenty London Borough of Lambeth. The bus driver said that the Thames link was closed to Tulse Hill, and the bus terminated there. But when I got there, there was no Thames link. But I did see a few Class 319s in Thames link livery pass through without stopping. I knew railway staff were stupid, but I didn't think they were stupid enough to terminate a rail replacement bus at a station short of that from which the line resumes. The station staff were rude and kept following me around, so I left and went on a walk around Tulse Hill. I saw a bridge with a temporary and a permanent low bridge sign. What's the point of having the temporary sign when there's already a permanent sign there? Then I got a bus to Herne Hill. It was a nice Boris Wright bus. Class 377. Which one is it? I'm having fun. I run away from everyone. A curly haired woman, a man in a hat, a cow and goat, and a silly old cat. And when they did to wear my reach the red tank, you stopped and shivered. Too cold. How do I cross? Then a fox appeared. I know little gingerbread man, he went. Overpriced Cathedral. Yeah. 
I don't believe in charging admission fees to churches. Yeah, yeah, I got an empty bit. <laughs> You have to buy a ticket to come in here and look how much it costs. £18 adult, £8 that Wow, come on, come on. I'm amazed. Going back outside. Let's go in the underground bit with the overpriced cafe. The disabled accessible entrance. Entry to the gift shop. And listen to it. What's in here? Is this the same as the door? No, it's locked. This is Wellington's tomb. Under here. This is the area with Wellington's tomb. And the audio guy is turning. What's in the staff only? Some stuff only stuff that's boring. The disabled accessible entrance. Let's see what's in here. Some ticket inspector. This is one new change. The reason they built this underground section because originally they were going to have an entrance to the tube station here. So over here, in this area with the Amazon locker where nobody goes, over there was meant to be a corridor to the tube station, and over there, a potential corridor leading to maybe a Crossrail 3 station. I like this building. Oh, an eco disc which I didn't know about. Let's see if I can look for it. Do a little lift off here. A hidden eco disc. This grand staircase is new. Doesn't look too nice when I came here. I just tripped on the stairs. Now this is a bright white eco discs. Oh, 
Go break from the bathroom. Hold it in a working button. That's the up chime of the one you change. And now on to Rotty Cricklegate Barbican. It says it's broken, but it's not. All the way up. expensive bar. And hang on, this is an up button. Why have they got it? This is the top floor and it's got an up button. So I don't know, Nika, this motor is hidden and you can't see it. Lovely chime. No chime? I'm not going until I hear a chime. Sorry. I am not going until I hear this and go, ah. This lift gets its floor numbering as ground and hard. I wanted to go that way. Well, it's faulty. It's the best. It's the best. It's a silly kind of platform lift. Oh my. What? That was a bit quiet. One you changed time. <laughs> then I went to Moorgate Station and on to Brent Cross on the Northern Line, changing at Camden Town. The London Underground has a draconian rule that prevents filming without a permit, and the only justification given was that the flash could dazzle the drivers. This is an open it door to fall, it's I don't stopped. care about that. It's in not UK, very eco-disky. And the underground accounts for subjects in the panorama. The flash is a public space, served a primarily utilitarian purpose. Yes, I am a queen. So it's gone up to one. Let's come on, make the one you change chime. One you change chime. Come on. Yay, come on. Yay! I really like that. A lift. Finally. It's no longer a service. So we can move that sign. Let's go up. It chimes as when it chimes when it departs. Which I think is odd. And this goes quite slowly. Then my camera ran out of battery. Even though just a few minutes earlier it just has 65% left. What? Loud. Eco disc. Yes. Never had an eco disc. Lots of buildings in London have an upper ground floor. 
eco disc and this lift, this lift is dark. This lift is so dark. London now has the lift from Selfridges. The lifts in Selfridges have been modernised and they're now horrible generics. This is what they used to look like because all of the parts were brought here. The lifts don't appear to have controls though. For some reason, um, they would have originally had a handle turned by an operator to make the lift go up or down. However, you, even though when they modernised the lifts, they would have most certainly removed the handle, they haven't got the handle at the museum. So this isn't the complete lift. This isn't the complete lift interior because they haven't got the control handle. They weren't automatic. That one and this one, and it has a down button that's going down. Oh, just my alarm, sorry. This lift's not very good. And it has two separate levels, which are the same level, but with the different doors. This is guideline lift services, and it's not very good. Lower four, car park. Yeah, it's a car park. Doors closing. That requires a key. That one as well. L2. I have an idea. You two. Uh, Number two, galleries, cafe, toilets. I'm going to go with the other lift. It went on to nudge mode. Let's go. This is a tiny lift, or oh, else it's just maintained by. It's actually an eco disc, it's like a cheap. Lower level three. Lower level three. Lower level five. It's a star phone. It's low. Let's see what's on L1. Lower level two. Ah! Oh, someone's getting in! In case you have a baby that makes you need to use the lift. Ooh. Ooh. Let's see what's here. This is an intermediate level with the theatre on it. Let's go in the other lift. This way, this way, this way, this way. That's me, Cody. This lift goes to some secret levels. I want to go to those. Now is the generic lift. This door is locked. That one's not locked. Door closing. goes to you one. The eco disc doesn't go there. Upper one, cool learning centre. Doors opening. It's just a learning centre. Boring. Doors closing.
I think that D, deliveries level, is the ground floor. Let's see what's on Garden Terrace and go down to D. Garden and Terrace. Level slowly. Doors opening. Lift going down. Garden Terrace level. Doors closing. Let's continue to deliveries level. It's probably a private level. It's the ground floor deliveries level. Deliveries. Somebody's left the key switch on for access to the deliveries level. Doors opening. This is the secret deliveries area. Wow. And that's the generic lift that goes back up into the museum. Wow, I got into the deliveries bay because someone left the key switch in for deliveries at keys. Go back up. Somebody left the key switch for deliveries on. Lift going up. Doors closing. Oh. I'm not allowed to get myself in the video. That's a security problem. Let's get out. Garden and terrace. Doors this lift opening. does not go to the ground floor. It's not true. It does go to the ground floor, it goes to the special deliveries part, the ground floor. And one of the City of London's unusual churches, and there's our next lift. It's the City of London's preferred lift company, Apex. Awesome grotty cripple gates. Seventies. A lift. With a podium level a podium level. Come on. Still for school. Oh, now I'm podium. It's not coming. Oh, car park is locked with a due or with a custom key switch. Maybe it's due. Uh, Eco-disc! That's an eco-disc.
the next thing 